All right, so I'm doing trauma counseling and I have no problem announcing it. Thank you, Izzy. Seems that Barney's a little too busy. All right, so my assignment to go through just reintegrating into what life is, I guess. This week was to publicly speak, which I often do here, every speaking week, um, about my inability to connect with people. Better tickle. Okay, so this is called Grown Into a Woman's Fabric. Assigned by my corrector of life, no games played or dot lectured. A price to claim, I love to write. Trauma, homework, tastes like nectar. Words are verse, I feel affection. Foreign ground, but I won't return. Pen or a mic, gotta mention a thing or two. Who knew needs attention? So let's talk about connection. Sorry, I get bad reception intentionally. Whoops, tight like sphinx. Vulnerability is a snapped rubber, no protection. Delta or Omnigron, or Omni got it wrong. I'm a transformer without infection. Expectations, don't expect it. Gone off the grid, no direction. If I let my time slip, best bet, it's only after a sip of tea. People think, damn, she's twisted. There's bars I also stand behind. When I leave, I start to miss it, like hundreds of handfuls of times. People appreciate me and want to say hi, running like tag to the woods from his wife on chase. Swerve, oh hello sir, now goodbye. Side hug girls, connect on social please. Can't let y'all know the pain inside. Embody, embody devouring me. So if I come off as ice queen, it's because I've been nailed to the cross, maybe lost, so find me. In a crown next time, I'm around this town. I'll join the gameplay, Yeezy, because my life was never easy. But when I step off the stage and turn to my cage, please remind me that all is fine. Life's full of love I have come to learn. I've always deserved. Poor reserve, cheers to your ears and the years, but who's counting time? I'm making it my new life. And this one's Assigned by, wait, hold up. Okay, sorry. That was it, that was it. I literally didn't post it twice. <laughs> sorry. Wait, no, 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 wait, there was one more verse, there was one more verse. Let me keep going. I fucked up here. Okay, hold up. Okay. The shoulder shrug, give me a hug. When I step off the stage and turn, to my cage and turn to my cage. Please remind that all I, that all is fine. Life's full of love. I have come to learn. I've always deserved. Again, poor reserve. Cheers to your ears in the years, but who's counting time? I'm making it my new life, and this one's gonna be easy. Little orphan, get to know me. My name is Annie. Thank you. Oh. oh. Sorry. I did. Yeah. Of course, I did. I wrote it this morning. Thank you. Okay, and this one was written yesterday. Thank you so much, by the way. It means a lot to me. All right, so I was on a boat yesterday celebrating. I've been basically going through, after getting some brain trauma from someone I gave my heart to, I enrolled myself in trauma counseling, and I'm going through the steps as hard as they go. And I've been, you know, taking every single thread that's been, you know, untied, and I'm untying it and I'm cutting it loose. Otherwise, I'd be just sewing my, or holding tight my own noose, if you will. So, started with family. Last week, I did a poem, and it was actually called God Damnly. But now I'm kind of realizing old friends aren't really what I thought they were. You know, like when darkness comes, they're not really there. And I went to go celebrate a friend's birthday, spent 50 bucks in just beers for everyone just to watch them all get drunk and debunk me for posting publicly that I'm not okay, that I'm coming undone and I'm fine with it. So they can go shove one. Mm -hmm. wow. 
I wouldn't though. I am almost 30. Why thank you sis, takes one no one. Shut up, you're not even watching it. You're too busy smoking a joint. I'm done with you, Barn. Sorry, I'm just trying to open this poem. <laughs> oh my god, I was just kidding, Barn. Right? Got my work phone, because I just started working again. Cheers to me. Thank you. All right, here we go. So this one is called My S My Swagger Includes a Dagger. Yeah! All right, and this is about being on a boat with a bunch of people I'd known since I was about 16. A couple of guys I hadn't seen in a couple of years hitting on me, and then everyone just kind of humiliating me. And I was a little too drunk to drive, and I admitted it, and I got hit with it because of that. So here it goes. Ha ha ha. For he he who. Woo woo. You hear him sirens coming? Best I saw the wall hit the ground running. You can't see me though. Play me off, cause I drive a ride I don't own. Trick daddy. Yeah, trick me. Don't pretend you're with me, or like you want to dick me. Be back. Yeah, I am mad. Washing dishes in both sewing and tearing my own stitches. Don't forget those little bitch fits where I feel it and it's sad. Just gotta know, are you? Real with me, bro. Otherwise, would suggest you leave me the fuck alone so I can be set free. Yeah, you like those pair of wings? They're under repair, though. Finally, see them chains broke. Open my chest, fucking breathe. Taking a good eye to see. Fake love shout down from above. Why won't any of you just ask me? To me it seems cowardly, or should be discussed personally. Not collectively, intentional is. That what you call loyalty? Or am I fucking going crazy? Why abandon one's strength? I know I've come and caged. Go on and disengage me. Like I'm okay saying publicly that I am not. Nor showing me at my raw. Must have lost some e-bras. Sorry, they asked if I had a sugar daddy because I was driving my boss's car down to Canyon Lake for that reference. So it's like Ebra, like kind of like, what's it called? All right, I get it. Gin joint, yeah, brewery, shooting darts, I'm in. Please silence the back seat, the center of the dark, looking up to the stars, shining and telling me there's no fuse without a spark. There's roses in the park. And Eleanor Rose, like Rose, but I meant like Eleanor Roosevelt, got it right about a hot tea bag. And if anyone doesn't know that reference, there's a quote by her that says, a woman is like a tea bag. You, or, or, you don't know her strength unless you put her in hot water. It just felt too familiar. Thank you. That was Annie, everyone. Let's get her for one more time. You can put on the mic, so that'd be wonderful. Up next to the microphone, we have Pat. 